This video is sponsored by Mudwater. I became a daily coffee drinker a few years ago because it seemed like a really fun little morning ritual everyone was doing and I was missing out on. But really, it just ended up making me anxious and giving me a nasty headache if I didn't drink just the right amount at just the right time. So I finally stopped drinking coffee, but really, really missed that cozy morning ritual of slowly waking up to the world while enjoying something tasty and warm. Mud water has been the perfect solution to that. It's a coffee alternative with four adaptogenic mushrooms and Ayurvedic herbs. They sent me their starter kit, which includes a 30 serving tin of mud, a USB rechargeable frother, and a sample of their vegan coconut creamer. I like to drink mine with almond milk and maple syrup, sometimes a dash of pumpkin pie spice. Mud includes ingredients such as cacao, chai, lion's mane, jaga, and cordyceps, which offer a huge range of benefits, like helping your mood, focus, physical performance, and immune system. It's 100% USDA certified organic, non-GMO, gluten-free, plant-based, Whole30, and kosher. I love that it still does have a dash of caffeine in it, about one-seventh of the amount is coffee. That way, I still get that nice pep in my step, but without the anxiety or dependence. Whether you want to get off of coffee or just looking for a tasty and beneficial ritual for your morning, try out Mud Water. You can get 15% off of their starter kit by clicking the link in my description and using my code MOON. Alright, everything seems to be in order. We've got the mat, the leaves, and our little brushes. I got the tickets on the bubbles, papers, the big fruit, and look at the markers. Hi there, hi. <laughs> Thank you so much for welcoming me back into your vaguely cattle corn scented home. I believe I've been summoned for a cranial nerve exam. Is that correct? Perfect. First, would you allow me to check out your cranial nerves? Just, you know, make sure everything is there. Perfect. So, let me just start looking into your brain. See what we find in there. Huh? Getting the tools behind the Oh yes, there it is. Looks like right here we have the olfactory nerve. That looks perfect. And then there's the optic. The oculomotor. Excellent news. All 12 of your cranial nerves are present and ready to party. Let's begin with the olfactory nerve. I'm going to ask you to identify each of the following fragranced markers to the best of your ability. Are you ready? It's going to be fun, I promise. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Give that a whiff. Raspberry, orange, apple, banana, blueberry, watermelon, cherry, was so quick. I think that must have been a world record. You're a sniffing star. Now, I'd like you to vibe check this puppy, please. Tell me if 
for putting you through such intense pressure, but you held up beautifully. I'm so proud of you. Yes, yes, yes. You should be very proud of yourself. Next up is the optic nerve, which we'll need Finley to assist us with. Come on out, Finley. So, Finley here is going to help us test out your optic nerve. He's trying to He's a little turned around. This is the right way, but he doesn't know that yet, so we're gonna help him find his way. Each time he leaves your vision like that, I want you to say, wrong way, Finley. Okay, here we go. Good. Marvelous. Yes. Beautiful. Absolutely. Gorgeous. And then, at long last, there we go. Perfect. Thanks to you, Finley is now at the potluck, sharing his famous lemon bars with all his closest friends. Now we can move on to you telling me how many fingers I'm holding up. But through this gidget here, here we go. Are you ready? I think you're up for the challenge. <laughs> Good. Perfect. Mm hmm Yes. Excellent. Mm hmm Very good. Yes. You're quite good at that game. <laughs> All right. Next, I'd like you to read out each of these lines to me. You see these here? Keep going. I want to find out the smallest that you can decipher. Here we go. Big bird. Medium bird. Little bird. Tiny bird. Itty bitty bird. Unbelievably baby bird. Crumb of bird. I can't believe it. so proud of you. What beautiful work. Now then, it's time for my personal favorite, 
the uh, pupillary light reflex. It's time to bring out the pyrotechnics. Oh, you seem a bit nervous. No, 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 no. That's all right. Don't be nervous. Don't be afraid. I, as a matter of fact, am a certified expert. <laughs> I earned my pyrotechnics certificate with a specialty in bottle rockets last summer at camp. Now let me be straight with you, this was all strictly below board, truly as under the table as it gets. None of the counselors were any the wiser, not even equal eyes, Evelyn. Every night. lights here and then carefully observe your pupils as they react to this spectacular new light source Turn those lights back on and I'll have you look right at this narwhal's nose so I can track your ocular movements as you follow his nose with your eyes all around down, assessing both horizontal and vertical up close and far away he's saying hi he's saying bye he's going over here don't you cry he's going over there can't say why <laughs> now dodge this <laughs> sorry to spoil you with that one. I had no choice. In order to obtain accurate reflex results, it had to be an ambush. Are you guys still cool? Wanna poop noses on it? <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Nice. <laughs> I will now gently apply alternating sensations on various areas and I want you to tell me whether it feels soft or pointy, pointy or soft. Here we go. Good. Perfect. Good. Good. Yes. Yes.
I would like you to tell me whether you feel the cool, refreshing breeze of the palm fronds on your left or your right. Here we go. Good. Mm-hmm. Good. Yes. Absolutely. Very good. Nice. Excellent. are not soap flavored, but in fact, strawberry kiwi flavored. And here we go. For the glosso pharyngeal and vagus nerves, I'd like you to cough for me, please. get compliments on that quite a lot. I'm pretty jealous. My cough sounds like a disgruntled duck. Yeah, like if you were to cut a duck in line, it's exactly the sound that duck would make. I'm sure you can imagine. Uh, for the vestibulocal nerve, I'd like you to repeat back to me whatever I whisper in each of your ears. Despite the fact I'll be making a nice little distracting noise in the opposite ear. Let's have a party. I can host. Little leprechauns buttering their toast. I don't get spooked when I see a ghost. Imagine a lighthouse. For the facial nerve, I'd like you to make a few expressions for me. First of which, puff your cheeks out like a puffer, puffer, puffer fish. Perfect. And then close your eyes really hard, like you're the seeker in hide and seek. Yes, good. And then raise your eyebrows like there's an unexpected pizza on your table. And smile real pretty, like it's your favorite kind, all the toppings you like the best. There it is, good, excellent, yes, perfect, yes, good, 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 good. Now, we'll finish off the cranial nerve exam with a complimentary brainwash. My clients all love this service. Most people don't even realize how dirty and foggy and clogged up their brain has gotten until getting it cleaned and suddenly you feel so fresh and so clear. So let me just open up your head. Are you ready? Okay, good. Here we go. I'll just grab my brain fetching net and use that to scoop de doop scoop de doop scoop 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 de doop up your brain. There it is. Oh, 
looks big and beautiful. Most people tend to get what I call concern critters built up over time, which need to be routinely removed in order to maintain a positive outlook. Uh, when was the last time you got your brain cleaned? Oh goodness, well, in that case, I expect to find about 8 to 12 concerned critters hiding in there. I am an expert, of course, so I will be able to locate and remove them quite quickly. Let's get started. Here we have your big, beautiful blue brain. It's quite good for it, too. Give it a nice firm squish. Just so. And a tippity tappity tap. It's like a massage. I bet you feel that, don't you? Do you feel that nice, nice brain massage? Good. Just bitter, bitter. certain critters in your mind. And don't you worry, the mind is perfectly malleable and pliable. And is, in fact, meant to be pulled apart in this fashion. This is not doing any harm whatsoever. In fact, quite the contrary. This is an incredible this is an incredibly therapeutic and healing process for the mind. Taking it apart bit by bit. Allowing your mind to aerate and refresh. Relax and rejuvenate. you any suffering. Oh, there's another seal, a teal one. We can join, join the other one there. They'll get to roam free where they Yeah, very. 
very scented brain soap. apply the water so it can get nice and fudsy. We can schedule you for brain cleanings on a regular basis from here on out. So you'll never have to experience that buildup of concern critters ever again. So just drying off all those suds, okay? completes your cranial nerve exam and cleanse for today. Is there anything else that I can help you with? Okay, great. Let's go ahead and scoop, scoop, scoop your brain back up. Like that. Put it back 
stuck in your head. Good night. Good night. My most treasured.